Well, thank you for joining us for Denver 7 News at 6 this Tuesday. I'm Shannon Ogden. And I'm Jessica Porter. Tensions escalating on the Auraria campus today with pro-Palestinian student protesters demonstrating inside the Tivoli Student Union during a meeting between protest leaders and the Department of Higher Education. The protests also prompting the Community College of Denver to move its commencement ceremony from the Auraria campus to its Lowry campus. Denver 7's Veronica Costa with details on the escalation and its impact. On Tuesday, protesters with Students for a Democratic Society made new demands in a meeting with the Colorado Department of Higher Education. In that meeting, we're going to demand exactly what we were asking for yesterday, a meeting with the Board of Regents, a meeting with the Board of Trustees for the respective schools, um, it, because those are the people that control the finances and resources of the schools. We will not stop, we will not rest. The meeting didn't go well for SDS members, which led to heightened tensions between protesters and police. Auraria campus officials sending out this message saying in part, quote, protesters entered the Tivoli Student Union and disrupted campus operations, adding in that statement, Quote, during the meeting, protesters demonstrated on the first and second floors inside the Tivoli Student Union. As a result, a spokesperson says police put zip ties and handcuffs on the doors of the Tivoli Student Union. Escalating tensions coming one day after Community College of Denver announced its commencement Thursday would be relocated from the Auraria campus to its Lowry campus. I checked my email and I saw that they had changed the address to here. Anaí Marquez picked up her cap and gown Tuesday morning, not sure how to feel about the changes. But it's a hard adjustment, but I think it's a good thing too. Um, especially with all that's going on in the Auraria campus. In a statement, CCD officials said in part, quote, protesters remain in their encampment on the Auraria campus and have informed campus leaderships of their plans to disrupt commencement, which is why they made the switch. Those student protesters say that's not true. We don't have demands against CCD. They're the furthest, their buildings are the furthest from us on campus, and so uh, the reactions from them of going online for school, moving their um, graduation, um, all of those things, um, you know, I, I don't think it's necessary. As for Anai, she's just glad commencement is still on. In Denver, I'm Veronica Acosta, Denver 7. And the commencements for the other schools on the Auraria campus, that is MSU and CU Denver, were already scheduled for the Denver Coliseum.